All right, so got the ELO 19 out this morning to do a little bit of testing. Water is looking really good early in the morning. Got a little bit of a fog coming off, but just smooth and just glass. So, you know, we got the new pickup on it on the Sponson design itself. You kind of see from there. So this is the first test with this. You know, I'm only going to do a couple laps here with this guy, five to maybe six of them. It's set up for a certain purpose. So, um, so it just doesn't need to run long. I got my GPS in it right now. So I can log some data on this, which is kind of cool with, you know, the, you know, this GPS here is you can go into track or you go into drag and then, you know, you can set your distance will actually give you a nice graph of what, you know, how the boat is handling, especially if you're coming around in a turn, you're trying to evaluate your turn, you know, what is your speed dropping into a corner, you know, what's your straightaway speed, you know, it's a really cool you know, way to kind of track it. So, you know, we're also going to. You know do that style of tracking i'll show it to you guys how it kind of works so right now you know i got it set for 2000 feet is what i'm gonna kind of expect to kind of run you know probably even farther but that's a good kind of set point for this today's test and then when we're done we'll check all the temperatures we'll evaluate how it runs and let's see so i'm gonna start it and gps is going right now it's testing and once it completes 2000 feet then the gps will record everything I'm just getting the hatch down and get a few laps in testing. Now, as you can see, I have changed the rudder on this one too. And uh, the rudder from the Pro Boat Impulse 32 fits just perfectly. And then the water pickups, you know, are big and open like that, you know, and on both sides. So we'll see how everything runs. Got the temperature gun, boat is on, it's working, and we'll see what it does. Now this is set up for, for 4S running, and for the hull and how it does, it's quite fast for what it is. Again, five laps, we'll take off. <laughs> quick good water flow let's roll it full trigger full trigger like she's quick I've already hit that buoy out there once but with different boat boat two laps Full trigger, full trigger. Full trigger, full trigger. Into a quarter, full trigger. This boat is a rocket for being what it is. I'd say two more laps, we'll pull it in, check temps. Water pickup is working great. Can't complain. Final lap, we'll see what it does. Full trigger, full trigger, top speed, top speed. All right, let's pull it in. <laughs> Grab the boat. Water pickup is exceed right there. Good water spray. Both ends. We'll see what the temperature is and we'll see what the readout is. We'll check temps first. I do got a couple other propellers coming in the mail. So I'm gonna be trying those out a little bit later and see. So that's where I'm kind of experimenting with a different water pickup. So the propellers are gonna be carrying a bigger diameter. 
a little bit more pitch on them trying to pick up a little bit more speed temp gun ESC Sixty-nine. Uh, to about eighty-five, eighty-six is eighty-seven. Motor. That was the new water pickup, which were one hundred and eleven on the motor itself. Well, one hundred and seventeen, one hundred and two, and batteries, ninety three. I think that's a good temperature. Now it's ready to read. See what's kind of cool? It shows you like that. So that one I was maxing about forty nine miles an hour. And you can see the readout up and down like that gives you kind of a readout what you know your overall top was and then what your overall lower was so i'm still experimenting with this one here a little bit i'm playing with it and so this is you know what i got for today for right now for this boat here we're going to kind of play with the setup a little bit more play with the different propellers and and see how it kind of does well thank you for watching please like and subscribe